Good afternoon. Good afternoon. It's 2.34. Yes, I left work early because we are back at the Center for Reproductive Medicine here in Orlando, Winter Park. Winter Park to be precise. Because where our doctor is, yeah. Yeah, so we had the last two months, obviously, of, you know, going to Chicago and being with the family and all that. So now we are back at it. Mm -hmm. And we're going to keep you updated as we go along. This is a... Uh... It was like the first visit to begin the IUI process. Yes. And if you're new to our channel, go to thebrookartproject.com and check out the blog post because that's where Sarah put all the details about like what is going right. on with all that. Yeah, we're not going to give you like a step-by-step -step as the process goes on this month. Um, we do have a step-by-step -step list of what is going to happen in that blog post. Um, so we're we'll going to end up going updated. anywhere from like three to five or six visits yeah, it's gonna to be the multiple. office this yeah. month. So, yeah, so we'll be today is the first one. So we're excited. Yes. We're home, or I should say, I'm home. Um, Sarah ran to Walgreens to get her prescription, and she's gonna pick up some Slurpees, because buy one, get one for the next week of Slurpees, and you guys know how we feel about 7-Eleven Slurpees. But I just wanted to give a shout out to Sarah, because she's the best, and um, anybody, like this whole process is, is very tolling on anybody, even though it's very exciting at the same time, but when you have infertility complications, like, it's, it's a struggle. And it's hard because a lot of that burden falls on Sarah. She feels very guilty that she is not pregnant. When it's, it's it is a team effort. It's it's we're in it together. But she does she does feel guilt from that. So Sarah, when you see this, I love you, and don't you know we're in it together. And so we're we're so optimistic. We have a, a plan for this whole month, as you like we said, go on our website, our blog, and you can see in detail like what's going to happen this month. Um, but we'll keep you updated as we go to the doctors. We don't want to talk about it all the time because. There's nothing to talk about for the next like two weeks now until the next visit, so we'll let you guys know new things as as they happen. But I'm on Matt and Ben's new bed. It got delivered, so Matt and Ben, if you see this before, uh, if this goes up before 10 a.m. tomorrow or noon, whatever time you guys get here, uh, fancy new beds here, super exciting. Eve is super weirded out by it because it's a big new object in our home. You don't even know you're getting new friends. You're getting new friends. <laughs> if you didn't know, it's buy one get one week at 7-Eleven for your therapy. They have to be mediums? Yeah, and I don't know if it was actually a good deal because they said like 99 cents for any size. So it's 99 cents for any size. Or buy one get one mediums? It's definitely more economic to get two larges for 99 cents each, rather than one want, at a dollar thirty. But I didn't want um, all that to juice. Have lunch. They're different. Oh, exotic! I also went and switched out of my switched out of my wallet into my old Disney Golf um, money clip because I'm obsessed with going golfing at Disney, even though I've never gone golfing. I've never gone golfing at Disney, and I don't pa own a pair of clubs, but I want a pair of clubs, but I don't know how expensive they are. And I want some, though, because our Platinum Plus annual passes give us one free round of nine holes every single day of the year. Um, I just knocked my Slurpee all over the ground. Sarah's first question was? Was it my Slurpee, was it my or was it your Slurpee? Because <laughs> you said I still have most of mine left, and I was like... I wasn't sure because I figured that the one that spilled a lot was not a lot left. <laughs> Alrighty, we're in the car. We forgot to mention today overall is going to be a little bit of a different vlog. Yes. If you haven't realized by now. Um, so Matt and Ben actually move in tomorrow. Matt gets here tomorrow. So... I think he's in like Virginia or something like that right now. Yeah. Right. So we have a handful of things that we still want to get done before he gets here. His mattress was delivered, finally. But before we do that, and before we get totally situated, we are headed over to the Bugs. Because little miss Joey Beth shattered her phone. <laughs> she didn't shatter her phone. She busted the LCD on her iPhone. Yeah. Like the glass is not broken, but the screen is. Right. So if you don't remember from a few months ago when I fixed Josh's phone, um, I'm going to fix Joey Beth's. So since I already did this cool fancy tutorial last time I fixed Josh's phone, I'm not going to do it this time, but uh, this is our progress so far. That's the old screen. The new one literally just showed up, what Josh, like 20 minutes ago yeah, while I was on the phone? Mm -hmm. So it showed up while I was working on it, so I'm actually going to, we're doing simple dinners here, just sandwiches and grapes. I think we got ice cream bars too. Ooh. Oreo ice cream bars. Yeah, Jessica's coming over. Jessica is coming over? Yeah. For certain? Mm -hmm. 
Nice. Jessica's been stalking me. We go to the same Publix, we found out. Real life. And then we saw her at Hollywood oh, Studios. She literally is. I think she knows that I had a guinea pig growing up. And she's got a guinea pig. We'll put her guinea pig on Instagram somewhere. Go follow it. They're cute. But I'm going to eat because I'm starving. Going, doctor. Going. Dr. Tony. We shall see. You know, to, uh, it's all back on. Well, she was already pretty old and feisty. It's looking good. Though. Old and feisty, just like us. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. We got a fixed screen. Oh yeah, and I'm gonna pass off to Josh because he used to do this kind of stuff. I can't do the screens. Look at that. That's uh, now both of you. So I'll just break uh, break Lucy's phone next when she gets Perfect. one, and I'll fix that one for Perfect. you. There you go. There you go. Hold on, mine because I just had cold with ice cream. I this have one of these like puppies. Sixth grade all over again. <laughs> We're about to play some some card games, but I wanted to show you the progress. Look how good that looks. It looks so good with the hardware. Having a riveting night. Are you but talking to yourself? I am, but I <laughs> me enjoy Beth are fighting. I didn't realize he had a camera. I was like, is he okay? Me enjoy Beth are fighting because that's what we do when we play games. <laughs> You're going down. Just saying, sleepy Sarah. You betrayed me too, by the way. I was unaware. Shame, shame, shame on us. We missed the tummy time and time just now. Uh, I had hot dogs and chips and an Oreo bar. And I didn't tell him about the dip. But uh, then I tried it and it wasn't that great. No, it's not good. It was weird. It's like sweet. It was the last. Walgreens, what are you doing with your dips? You're supposed to be convenient for I, last minute things. I thought that there was going to be a We're going home though. Sour cream dip. Look at this shirt, I want it. You can have it. The room is empty. I'm just going to vacuum it tomorrow. Show them the closet. Oh yeah. Guys. I, from downsizing, I have so many extra hangers, I told Matt not to buy any. Wow. We, those are our hurricane sandbags that never yeah. got wet last year. Yeah. So we figure, just keep them. Mm-hmm. Um, the only other thing in here is the this rug and inserts for our kitchen table. This? absolutely wild to me that we accomplished this. I know. Like that closet empty, this bedroom empty. This was essentially a big storage unit. Yeah. Even in close, come over the back, even in close to the bathroom. This, I think I don't know if we've explained it before, this is actually considered the master bed and bath. Yeah. But we love the window in the other bedroom more. Mm hmm So this we bathroom also. is massive. Look at the storage. Yeah. So this is like what we're gonna keep They'll have the bottom. That's more like housekeeping toilet. Yeah, this is like check. anybody can have. But they also, on top of like these technically three shelves, mm -hmm. they also have this mirror opens up and they've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. We don't have that in our bathroom. No. I'm not complaining, I'm just saying. This is a yeah, big size bathroom. Big size too. bathroom. So we're feeling nice and accomplished. Oh! Excuse me, do you have an appointment? Does it feel like Christmas Eve for you? Why? Because Matt is coming. Oh yeah. 
I was like, is it because we just did a bunch of cleaning? <laughs> no, because it's like everything changes it hasn't hit, tomorrow. It hasn't, it hasn't yeah. Hit me. Yeah. It is two in the morning, and we're getting up in a few hours because we have to do some tidying up and cleaning um, in the morning before I go to work. I think we have a little bit more we can do, a little bit more, and then some reorganizing and figuring out because we have like probably twelve bins. Yeah. Our Empty room bins. right now is like the least put together, it's but it's like, also more put together in some ways because we've like really condensed our closet, gotten organized, some things some organized and have been so. But we've got like, good. we have that bench that we want to refinish that's in there kind of in the shovels. We've got about four bins of stuff we might either donate, give away or sell. Like Disney stuff, mm -hmm. um, so we don't want to leave that in Matt and Ben's room, and we don't want to leave it out and about. So it's it's in our it's bed. In our room for now. Yeah. Does my eye look like it's swollen? Um, no, it's just get real tired. <laughs> True. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>